great care of myself every single day. I am grateful for everything and everyone around me. I found exercise, stay fit and healthy as my daily priority. I am strong, powerful and confident. I have discipline in all areas of my life. I will not settle for a mediocre life. I stay true and faithful to myself and my mission and still be the best wife, mother and a friend. I believe in my abilities to figure things out. Therefore, I do not allow myself to be overwhelmed. I have a clear vision of my purpose in life and I do not put guilt on myself for following my dreams. I dream, visualize, plan and follow through with my action. I seek no approval, yet respect others. I strive to be a better version of myself every single day. I understand that success is a journey and not a destination. Therefore, I must put in the work every single day. I have a beginner mindset and learn new things every single day. I make no excuses and accept any. I am confident that I will be adding more to this creed as I get older, wiser, and learn more from those who had done it already. No excuses. Good morning, Peak Freaks. Tuesday morning, boxing. Body weights today, again, you really don't need anything other than your bag to kick, to punch, and we're going to have some fun. There is a intense cardio involved today. So <clears throat> let's roll. I see you wrapping your hands. Okay. <clears throat> we're going to start with light jumping jacks, just light on your feet, just legs only. Just kind of get going. Yes, wrap your hands if you're using the gloves. That's very, very, very important. Light on your feet, guys. Light on your feet. You can't jump. You can step out to the side just like this. Keep on going. Light on your feet. Brace your abs. Shoulders back, chest is up. Good, we're gonna stop for a second. You can stretch your calves. So now calf stretch is always against something. So maybe toes are up, heel is down, lean forward, stretch the calf, hold for two, three seconds, and do the same. You can lean against anything. As long as the toes are up, heel is down, you're gonna lean forward and you're gonna feel a good stretch running through the back of your calf. Now we're gonna do light on your feet, just front and back jacks. Let's do this. Front and back jumping jacks. I want to make sure that I have a good view here. Nice. Okay. I see, Joseph, you are ready. Perfect. So you, your hands are up. Nice work. Just light on your feet here. We're going to warm up the calves. In boxing, there's a lot of calves involved, right? A lot of calves. Good, and we're gonna switch to just quad stretches, walking forward, walking forward. And now stepping back, we're gonna go into active hamstrings, lower back stretch, reach, open up your chest. Reach, open up your chest. There you go, a few times like this. Good, now we're gonna skip forward. Just a little skips like this, and light jack up. So you're raising your knee, to the opposite arm, okay? And light, jump back, again. Skip forward, boom, and as you're going, those arms are being raised a little higher each time, okay? So again, you start with your right leg and left arm up. Now you wanna reach up and jump up. Keep on going. Keep on going. So reaching, reaching, reaching up. Up, up, and light jack. Of course, scoring just me. One more time, one more time. Very good. We're going to start into being in our boxing stance position. If you are righty, your left leg is forward. Right leg is slightly across, diagonal. We're going to start shuffling forward. Just the shuffle. I want you to show me the standard stance position. Left leg is leading forward, 
and then right leg is behind. You see, my feet are not in line. They are, I'm not just going like this. I want my hips and shoulders positioning the opponent forward. So left leg forward. When I go back, my right leg is leading. But I feel like I have a block in between my legs. Always the standard stance, okay? Just like that. There you go, hands are up, elbows are tucked in. You're protecting your face throughout the whole time, okay? We're gonna start with just the jab, boom, forward. When you go back, you're gonna go cross. Jab, boom, cross, boom, across. Jab is forward, cross is back. And again, jab, boom, this is just the warm up, cross. One more time, jab. Cross. We're gonna go three now. Three. Forward. Four. Back. And again, three. Forward. Right here. Turn, 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 pivot. Both hooks have to pivot. Hands are up. Elbows are tucked in. Hands are up, protecting the face. Lighter your feet. Boom. Turn. And a turn again. One more time forward. One more time back. Now forward, left upper, left, aiming for the chin, right upper, back, and again, forward, left, back, right. So you see how I'm twisting, how I'm turning, but my hands are staying up. I'm using whole torso right here, this hip section, turning, feeling it like you would do on an oblique crunch. There's a lot of abs involved in that motion, and again, when you're shuffling back, pay attention to your feet. Pay attention. See? I want those feet to be always in that position, never close to each other. Good. Now we're going to go knee, back, knee, right, forward, left knee, back, right knee, go, forward, left knee, back, right knee. Again, again, again. A few more times like that. One more time forward, one more time backwards. And then we're gonna switch. Kick left on the back. Kick right. Don't kick it hard yet. Just nice and soft, nice and easy. This is still a warm up. We wanna warm up these hamstrings a little bit more. And we're gonna stretch them. Okay? A few more times like this. There you go, shuffle forward, shuffle back. Good, and time, look, you can have a chair, stool, something in front of you that you can rest your leg on. I want that straight position, look just like this. Left leg is up, reach forward, open up the chest, stretch your tricep, and again, reach forward, open up the chest, stretch your tricep, keep on going, same leg. How do you stretch your tricep? When you bring the arm up, arm is up, you're placing opposite hand over the elbow and you're pulling gently towards the back while this hand goes to the opposite shoulder blade. And once achieve that motion, you're pressing and that's how you're gonna stretch the tricep. Good, switch your legs. Now both shoulders, hips are square towards that leg. The same idea, you're gonna stretch the tricep each time after you're stretching the leg. But make sure when your leg is up that you do not point your toes. You gotta flex your foot. So toes are towards you. Just by doing this and then elevating that leg, you're already hitting that hamstring right there and the calf. So keep on going a few more times. If you have a good flexibility, that leg can go a little bit higher. If you have something higher than your knee level, that's perfect. But if you're new to it, do not raise your leg too high up, okay? Because if you go into a 90 degree angle with something that's pretty high, you have to have a good flexibility. You must know about it. All right. And time. Show me one, two, three, four, five, six motion. And we are good to go. Let's do it. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, and six. And lie on your feet. One, two, three, four, five, six, and light on your feet. There you go. So get 
Get yourself ready. Because the first one is already intense. We're starting all out today. So listen up. This is how it goes. We're starting with a squat thrust. Squat thrust, jump out, jump back in, back to the stance. One. Then squat thrust, jump out, jump back in, stance. Two. Squat thrust, three. Squat thrust, four. Squat thrust, five. Squat thrust, six. You're going straight for the single punch each time. You going, start, three, two, one, you going. Keep on going. You guys are advanced here. For those of you who will be replaying, cannot do a squat thrust. I want you to either place your hands somewhere high and you can just step, 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 stand up straight. Look, using this tool, I can still do a squat thrust. Lower you go, harder it is. You can just walk it. All right, this group, Josephine and Joseph, they are advanced, they can do this, but you guys can walk your way out or just place your feet out, out and in, stand up straight, stand back to the punching. So we're adding a single punch, squat thrust, jack, squat thrust, cross, squat thrust, three, squat thrust, four, yes, Joseph, on the bag, squat thrust, five, squat thrust, six, and back to the beginning, non stop, looping around. You're looking around, you have six seconds. Good, we're going into one, two, left kick, one, two, right kick. You don't have a bag, you're moving around. One, two, left. One, two, right. Shuffle, non-stop motion. You have a bag, you're kicking the bag. You are kicking the bag, there you go. Just the thing is, oh, body weight. Remember, one, two, left kick, there you go. So there is no switch steps. That's it, right from that one, two, you're following that kick. Keep on going. One, two, left, one, two, right. Go, go, go. All right, either your friend is gonna join or he is no distraction to you. <laughs> I don't know if it's a friend or someone or your relative. <laughs> Tell them, either they joining or they not. <laughs> Go, go. One, two, left kick. One, two, right kick. Let's do it. Let's do it. All up. Keep on going. Strong, strong, strong. Nice work right there. There you go. Hands are up. Good, and switch. Back to one, two, jab. One, two, squat thrust. One, two, cross. You're starting again. Go. Go, Josephine. Squat thrust, jab. Squat thrust, cross. Squat thrust, three. Squat thrust, four. Squat thrust, five. Squat thrust, six. There you go. And back to the beginning. If you finish at six, the clock's still going and you're doing squat thrust. Back to the jab, back to the cross. Yes, we are looping around nonstop. Just watch that lower back, squat low, squat low. There you go. Good pivot on that left foot. Good pivot on the right hook. Left upper comes towards the chin. Right upper comes towards the chin. You stay light on your feet nonstop. Again, squat thrust, jab, squat thrust, right back to the stance, cross. Now you know what's coming. One, two, left kick, one, two, right kick, let's do this. One, two, left, one, two, right. For those of you who don't have a bag, you shuffle and you're moving around. Show me. One, two, left kick without switching. With switching, without doing the switch step, it's one, two, kick, one, two, right kick. So no switch, Joseph. Go, one, two, boom, one, two, right. And you're shuffling around. Yes. Nice, Josephine. Good job. Good job. Kick it. One, two, boom, left. One, two, right.
Nice work, nice work. Almost there, almost there. And time, one, one more time, Bruce. Squat thrust, jet, squat thrust, cross. Go, 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 go. Right away, add some push up right now to that squat thrust. Add a push up all the way down. Chest touches the floor, literally. Go, go, go. Always go back to the stance. Remember, after the squat thrust, don't just do a punch. Squat thrust, when you do a push up, jump back, stance, jab. Okay, always going back to the stance. This is boxing, so it's not just boot camp. We add an element of the boot camp into the boxing, but you have to go back to the stance. Keep on going. And switch. One, two, left kick. One, two, right kick. Go, go, go. One, two, left. One, two, right. You guys are on the bag. You're kicking ass right now. We don't have a bag. Don't worry. Strong core right here when you're lifting that leg and you're kicking. Nice, Josephine. Nice, nice. Yeah, for those of you who are playing, you're going all out. You show up. This is your hour. Straight through. Hard intensity. Hard, hard. Hard for workout. There you go. Send those legs a little bit on those kicks. Sometimes you might even try it without the bag. Time. Shake it, shake it, shake it. Stretch it, loosen up. And go into a high plank position for me for a second. Go, high plank position. Hands underneath the shoulders. Right here, we are holding. Elbows slightly bent. You do not hyperextend your elbows. This should be a straight line position right here. Shoulder, hip, knees, ankles. We do not sink down like this. We are lifting and pulling the belly button into the spine. I want you to squeeze your glutes, your inner thighs, stiff as a board, tight and strong, holding that position. Fix your shoulder blades, do not round the upper back. No rounding upper back, that's very important. Not sinking down with your hips. Once you're gonna engage your quads, inner thighs, abs, glutes, that's become more of a control. In three, two, one, time. We are going right into a crawl out, guys. So crawl out is gonna be the same. You're gonna squat down, feet are wider than your shoulder width. You're gonna squat low, crawl your hands out to a high plank position, one hand at a time, stand up straight, jump into the stance, jab, then crawl up, cross, crawl up, three, crawl out, four, all the way up to six. And then I'm gonna show you what we're gonna do next with the kicks. Let's do this in three, two, one. You are going. Crawl out, jab. There you go. Quick hands. Pam. Nice work. Joseph is working with the bag, and the bag is swinging, and that's what matters. It swings. He comes right into it, punching. There is no waiting for the perfect punch on the bag. You got to let that bag swing. You are attacking each time. There you go. Josephine is doing body weight. Nice. There is no stopping. You finish six. You're starting back to the crawl up and going jab. Then back to the crawl up, going cross. There is no break right here. We're going straight through, okay? You can slow down if you cannot keep up the pace, but you are going. There is no stopping, okay? And you can, you can really control the speed here. You can go super fast or you can go really slow. We're going into, look, two, three, left kick, two, three, right kick. Go for it. Two, three left, two, three right. You're going. Time is up, time is up. There's no 
like no break, so it's immediately starting. I'm gonna restart the clock for you so you guys are not having a little break here. Go, go, go. Now, two is cross, three is left hook. Bam, then two, three, right kick. There is no switching the sets. That's the challenge right away. After the punch comes the kick. On a bag, it might be a little bit more difficult. You might want to shuffle just to have a full extension here because you don't want to be close, too close to the bag, right? I want to see pivots. There you go, I want to see pivot. For those of you who are working with the dumbbells, like dumbbells, make sure that you're not hyperextending your elbows. There is a slight bend in the elbow. Light dumbbells, two, three pounds, that's it. We do not work with any heavier than that. About 12 seconds remaining and immediately going right into the crawl out, okay? There is no break. Three, two, one. You're pushing the crawl out. Go, go, right away, right away. I want you to all count the crawl out. Count the crawl out, go faster than before. Count each crawl out. You can count out loud. Speak out loud, say the number. All right, at the extension, when you stand up fully and go right into the stance. Remember, quick hands out, quick hands in, bang, stands, boom. You're going fast. You're counting the crawl out and you want to keep the same number. Now imagine, so when we do the PFT test every month, this is not going to be most likely the same number because you're adding a punch here, but you can go for the same number, okay? The goal should be to push yourself in that hour with that punch, we have about 15 seconds to go. We are not slowing down. We are not slowing down. That's the whole idea. Boom, there is a lot of going up and down. You're going to be sweating. This is intense session when you're standing up and going down, right? Three, two, one, right into the kicks. Go, two, three, left kick, two, three, right kick. You are attacking. Go, go, go. Turn, let your body turn on that cross. You have to get a position of a turn here, okay? We're gonna have sipping water after these rounds. There you go, there you go. This is number two. We have one more coming up like this. Yes, 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 this is a challenge. That's the whole idea. Kick it strong, but don't hyperextend your knees. When you kick it, raise that leg. Think about your abs right there. Yes. And then here, boom, strong kick, boom. Light on your feet, non-stop, non-stop motion. There you go, there you go, right there, right there. Good work, good work. Three, two, one, go, right into crawl out. This is your last one. Stick to the same number that you had. Crawl out, jab, crawl out, cross. Quick hands crawling out, I'm gonna remind you, boom. Jab, crawl out, cross. Oh, yeah. We are blasting through this. You guys are going. Nice work. Squat down low, okay? Squat down low. Feet should be wider than your shoulder width. Feet wider than your shoulder width. Come to that hook and turn. Come to that right hook and turn. On the left upper, you aiming for the chin. Good, good, good. 10 more seconds. We're gonna start with the kicks. One more time through it. Three, two, one, go, right away. Two, three, left kick. Two, three, right kick. But don't get sloppy with the punches. Two, three, left. Two, three, right. Don't just go like this. No, good, good technique. Good technique. Pay attention to the technique. That's important. Turn, don't just throw an air ball. Turn on that left hook. Go for it, go for it. You have 30 seconds right here. Go, go, go. Almost there, almost there. 
Finish strong. Finish strong. We have five, four, three, two, one. Time. Quick sip of water and return. Quick sip of water and return. You got to drink water, guys. I've been incorporating this more since yesterday because I see a lot of people do not drink enough water. If you just dehydrate it just a little bit, it changes your performance, literally. Dehydration leads to 30 to 40% of performance. You can't work out like this. So let's hydrate it and let's go back. Listen up. Now we're going to go into a push-up to an animal sit. Okay, so we're going to start right here on the floor. Feet's gonna be just a little wider, okay? Pay attention. We're doing a push up. Push up, right from the high plank position, you're gonna sit and then lead to a push up. Sit on your heels. Push up, sit on your heels. Go. Push up, sit on your heels. Push up, all the way down. So the hands should not be changing your position. It's more of a close grip. Now, for those of you who cannot do push-ups, listen up, you do not do push-ups on your knees. You have to have something elevated. How to do it because it's long. You can perform a push-up. If you want, you can even squat down. Look, I'm using a chair to do that. So this is totally fine. Go for it. We want to go through full range of motion with this, but elevate it. Each time you elevate something, it's gonna become a little bit easier when you're using upper body. Unless you're using lower body, elevation actually becomes more harder if you are on the floor doing push-ups and your legs are up. Few more seconds, all the way down, there you go. Push up, push and sit on your heels, there you go. Few more, few more. Four, three, two, one. Come up, shake it, shake it. And we're gonna start with the next one. Next one. Listen up. Now we're gonna go into high knees. So we're gonna have one, two, three, four, jab. One, two, three, four, cross. One, two, three, four, three, and so on. Right into the kicks will be three, four, left kick. Three, four, right kick. Let's do this. And three, two, one, go. Four high knees, back to the stance, and a jab. If you guys cannot do high knees, you're going to be stepping, marching really fast back to the stance, jab. One, two, three, four, stance, cross. Back to right here. One, two, three, four, stance, left hook. There you go, there you go. Nice. Nice, Josephine. Raise those legs up. Good. Bum, 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 bum. Stance. Boom. So I always want you to reset in the stance. Okay? Always the stance. It's a single punch, so it's power. It's power. It's not, it's, 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 it's a powerful, strong one punch. That's what you're aiming for, okay? So it should be a good technique. You should pause for a second with that stance and throw a good punch. Because those high knees will raise your heart rate really hard. And switch. Three, four, left kick. Three, four, right kick. Let's do it. Three, four, left. Three, four, right. For those of you who do not have a bag, let's shuffle. Boom, boom. <laughs> boom. Like in your feet, a little reset. There you go. Attack the air. You are the air attacker. <laughs> Let's do it. Nice strong kick. I feel it. When I raise those legs, it's all abs. Right heel, our gut. Let's get work on that little gut. Right? There you go. Right there, right there. That's so now. Uh -uh. Three, four, boom. Three, four, bam. Light on your feet. Oh, yeah. Nice work. Good. Kick it, kick it. Get it hard. Three, two, one. Back to your high knees. Go, go, go. You know what to do. One, two, three, four. Stands, jab. One, two, three, four. Stands, cross. One, two, three, four. Left hook. One, two, three, four. Right hook. 
Nice work. Good job, everybody. Breathe out with each punch. Hands are up, do not drop your hands. Because when you're doing high knees, this is much harder than just keeping your hands here. Your body requires more calories to keep your hands up. Yes, 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 let's do this. Pum, 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 good. High knees, good. There you go, turn. Seven seconds, seven seconds. We're going right into second round of the three, four. Go, three, four, left kick. Go, 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 three, four, right kick. Joseph, I want you to do body weight on those kicks right now. Stop using the bag, move around. Just, there you go, I want you to do that. Go, three, four, air, and then, or air kick. You can go three, four bag and throw that kick outside of the bag, okay? There you go. There you go, right there, go, go, go. Squeeze your abs a little bit more. There you go. You might feel these kicks better like this. Go for it. There you go, squeeze your abs. There you go, powerful punch. Because with, with front kicks, it's hard when you're close to the back on that, on that three, four, you don't have a full extension. Either you go boom, step away, kick it, okay? Literally, sometimes those air kicks are much better. Three, three, two, one. Back to your high knees. Less time, less time. Go for it. High knees, high knees. Go, 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 go. Hands are up. We do not run in place. We keep your hands up in a guard like this. Boom, jab. Cross, pivot. Hook, pivot. Right hook, pivot. Left upper still is not stiff. Look, I'm following with my leg. And my abs, I'm right upper following the other leg. So it's not just here. There you go, there you go. Nice work. Good, good, good. High knees, keep those elbows tucked in. It should be difficult. It should be. You're going for it. Hands are up. Yes. Boom, high knees, pump it up, pump it up. Or just step, you can't jump, you stepping. Three, two, one, kicks, kicks. Three, four, left kick, hit it, hit it. Three, four, right kick, three, four, left, three, four, right. There you go, don't slow down on me, don't slow down on me. Don't make extra steps. When the bag is here, outside, you stay in front of the bag. Boom. Three, four, left. Three, four, right. Abs are on fire. I feel them just from few repetitions. Boom. Bam. Light on your feet. Three, four, kick it. Three, four, kick it. 10 more seconds. Finish strong. Yes. Water coming up. H2O coming up. And time, drink your water. You have your chance right now. You have your chance right now. Good. Listen up. We're gonna do a push out to a sit out on one side. So, right from here, when you're gonna do a push up, you're gonna do a sit out on one side. Then turn back to the push up, sit out on the other. Push up, sit out, push up, sit out. Remember with that sit out that we are going across with the opposite, opposite leg. Opposite hand. So even on the chair, look, you can do a sit out on a chair because you're raising, you're raising right arm, left leg, you're coming across. Go. Time, push up, sit out right, push up, sit out left. You guys are going. This was the first push up I have done for the past two weeks with my arm. Actually, seems semi okay. 
Go. Twist. I miss those push-ups. Let me tell you, when you can't do something, you are missing it so much and you love it. Okay. Go for it. Go for it. Push-up. Sit up. Strong push-up. We do not rush the push-ups. The whole goal is to go all the way down. You guys doing the chair push-up. You going with your chest. Whole body is going down towards that chest, towards that bench, chest, all the way down, twisting, turning on that chair on the couch. See, all of you can do it. Just a little help with a chair or a couch, and we are good to go. And time, shake it, shake it, stretch it. Maybe your legs, maybe you should stretch some legs right now. Those quads should be on fire. Your edge should be on fire. Maybe you want to lay down on your back a little bit, stretch your arms overhead, or if you have a stability ball, stretch it for a second, sip your water, and we're going forward. All right. Stepping up our game. We're going a little farther in advance here. We're doing a squat on both legs on single squatters. What I mean by that? You're squatting on both legs. You're squatting down, hands are here, jumping out and landing on a single, the other leg is in the air. Then right into both, stance, punch. Then when you squat, when you land on the other leg, you have to alternate those legs. Boom, cross. So you're landing between Left and right. Look, I landed on a single, jumping on both, stance, then jumping on the other single. Okay, got it? We're gonna do a little circle de soleil here. Show me what you got. Go. Show me what you got. Land on that single, the other leg is extended. The other leg is doing so much work. So you better extend. Like a ballerina behind you. Squeeze it. Squeeze that leg that is off the floor. Don't be just loose. Yes. You can totally do this on the couch when you squat and you jump on a single. Look at that. Off. Sense. Punch. For those of you who cannot fully jump, no excuses here. This should be fine. So, so many of you. Or go a little lower. If this is too easy, because you might think you can't do it, but then you're actually going to do it and you're going to be, huh, this is easy. So don't assume immediately that you can't. So watch, we're going five, six, left kick, five, six, right kick. Oh yeah, kicking a lot. Five, six, left kick. Five, six, right kick. Power, power, intensity here. There you go, kick the air. There you go, Joseph, right away. You can do five, six, right kick. Boom, nice, Josephine. There you go, attacking the air. Good job. When you raise that leg, Josephine, I want that leg high. I want that leg high so it feels uncomfortable in your belly button, right there in that midsection. So five, six on that right kick. Raise that leg. It's almost like a crunch, okay? Because if you're gonna go here and here, that's cutting the intensity almost 80%. We gotta raise that leg and remind, remind you, if you, if your legs go higher, your arms go higher, that's when you're boosting your whole heart rate, right? So you gotta raise that leg pretty high. And time, switch, squat cross, single, land on, squat on both, land on a single, go for it, go, 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 go. Squat both, land single, land single up, back on both. So squat both, land single, squat both. Okay. Squat, single, squat, stance. Squat, single, squat, stance. Got that single leg. Each time, a little different. There you go, there you go. Don't slow down on me. This is not my computer that is slowing down. You guys slow down on me. Joseph, deep breath in and go.
three, two, one, five, six, left kick, five, six, right kick, go for it, go for it, go for it. Five, six, attack, left, five, six, right. You're gonna get that energy. High energy stimulates high energy. If you're gonna be just moving around thinking how you're tired, how much you are tired, you're not gonna get it out. It's impossible, no. You gotta think, yes, yes, I am just gonna feel that session. I am going to put all out 100% here. Because we have one more to go of both. Squeeze it, kick it, punch it. There you go, there you go. Five, six left, five, six right. Five, six left, five, six right. Go. Nice. One more time, one more time. Squat ball, land single. Stand, jab, squat, ball, land, single, cross. Yes, 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 yes. Go, 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 go. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Hands are up. Awesome job, guys. We're not gonna go back to this one. We still have two groups and we are perfect on time to actually finish them. Five, four, three, two, one. Kick it, five, six, left kick. Last time, last time, Josephine, look at me, you got this. Five, six, left kick. There you go, five, six, right kick. Nobody with the replay is stopping. The phone will like track you down. Do you know that phones listen to the conversations? I tell you, they do. So they're gonna follow you around. They know that you left the room. So you better stay here and do it. Go, 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 go. Bam. <laughs> Bam! Fight light on your feet. I have a ghost in the house. Just open the garage door. <laughs> go, go, go. Joseph, you are in the fight. If you're not going to get it together, the opponent will kick your ass. There you go. Nice work. Awesome. Shake it. Sip your water. We can say Nazdrovye right here. Not only uh, drinking other uh, beverages, but we can say Nazdrovye when we drink water. Sip some water. Where's your water, Josephine? Where's your water? All right, listen up. We're going into a push up. Then we're gonna go high cut to touch the toe each time. So you're gonna do a push up, full push up, then high cut left, push up, high cut right. Okay, so you're gonna lift your hips up, reach towards the toes. It was still a little awkward. I was trying with my arm, but it, it's okay. So you guys going all the way out. With that push up, you go and you go and time is ticking. Push up, high up, push up, high up. You're going all the way down. Listen, you know when you're going halfway through the push up. You know. So push up, go literally, your chest should be pretty much crushing the floor. All right, that's a good push up. Abs tight. There's so much abs in push ups. Crazy amount of abs, people think it's just the chest and arms. No, it's a tremendous amount of abs to push yourself off the floor 60%. Go for it! Nice, strong high cup, touching the right arm to the left, left toes. Yes, it's all possible, even if you are doing it on the couch. 
Yes, you can. Three, two, one. Come up, shake it, jump it up, shake your limbs. Let them fly, loosen up, stretch your legs for a second, stretch some quads, maybe some hips here, loose, maybe some calves. And we are going into a single leg rollout to a punch. I hope that you knew that it's coming. It's coming. Single leg, squat down, pull your hands out, pull them back in, look. Right into the stance, boom, jab, then switch your leg. You gotta switch your leg each time, okay? So alternating between left and right, we are going in three, two. This is a powerful, powerful 15 minutes. One, go. 15 minutes left. Go, go, go. Crawl out, stand up, right into the stance, jab. Single leg, other leg, crawl out, crawl out, all the way. When you're crawling out on that single leg, you gotta squat low. Look, squat low. Crawl yourself out. Crawl yourself back in. Boom, push, stance, cross. Yes, yes, yes. Keep on going. Keep on going. Nice, nice, nice. Keep on going. Good work. And switch. We're going immediately to right knee, left kick, right knee, right kick. No punches right now. Go for it. Just knee and kick. Go, go, go. Nice work. Great job, everybody. Great job. I'm right here, just looking at the screen here. <clears throat> so knee, kick, knee, kick, and reset. Knee, kick, knee, kick. Go for speed and reset. 10 more seconds. We're going right into single leg crawl out. Three. Two, one, go. Single leg crawl out, changing the legs. Go, single leg crawl out, jab, single leg crawl out, cross. Abs are on fire after the squat rest and crawl out. So many repetitions. Your legs should be like literally shaking right now. There you go, there you go, there you go. Power, power, power. Look, you got this, you got this. Push, 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 stand up straight. Boom. There you go. Stand up fully and then after when you go and punch, just from stand up on that single leg. Don't cheat halfway through and bring the other leg in, okay? We fully have to achieve a standing position, go, knee and kick, knee, kick, knee, kick. You can literally travel around the house. Boom, 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 boom. This is just lower body here. Yes, 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 good job, good job. Knee and kick, knee and kick. Nice work, nice work, light on your feet. Keep on going, guys, keep on going. 12 seconds. 12 seconds, I'm just snapping a picture, so just keep on punching. Three, 
two, one, crawl out, crawl out, go for it, go for it, crawl out, crawl out, go, 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 crawl out, boom, there you go, and again, crawl out, punch, nice, go for it, I want to see it, high intensity right now, high intensity, single leg crawl out, punch, Good the work. I'm back. I didn't go anywhere. I'm still right here. I am still right here. Go, go, go. Single leg. Of course, just picking picture. Ten more seconds. Ten more seconds. Three, two, one, and last one. Knee kick, last one, knee kick. Knee kick for this round. We have one more round to go. You're doing so good that you can actually finish it. Look at this. Power, power, boom, 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 boom. Hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it, move around. Move around like the bouncy ball. More, a few more. We have 15 seconds. And time. Let's not shake it. Shake it. We're going to go into a push up. Alternating arm wrist, alternating leg lift. So let's do this. Push up. Push up, lift, 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 right into a push up. Go. So, right arm, left arm, right leg, left leg. You are going in three, two, one. Go. Time is starting. Push up, right arm, full extension, left arm, full extension. Lift that leg, not too high. Squeeze your glutes. There you go, right there. You need to go really high to hyperextend that lower back. I want you to really concentrate on the core, on the glute hamstring squats, full elongation of the arm, really nice strong arm, lifting by the ear. That's your goal. So lift just the arm, one arm at a time. Almost there, about 20 seconds remaining. About 20 seconds right here. Three, two, one. Come up, come up. Shake it, shake it. Listen up for a final one. This is it. We're gonna squat on single and land on both. Okay? So what he, what I mean by that, it's a squat thrust on a single. Landing on both, squat press on a single, then stands jab. So then you're gonna switch squat on single, land on both, cross. You're looping around through your legs. You have to achieve a full stand up. So again, from look, single, both, single, stands jab. Single, squat, jump, both, single, stands. Okay, you're looping around through these. Going all the way through. Look how easy it is. It's just single punch. Three, two, one, go. We didn't make complicated punches today because already the footwork is enough. So you just need to work about your switching your legs. That's it. From left to right. So single squat, land both, single. For those of you who are using the couch, we'll be right here. Let's try to squat down, touch the couch, jump on both. Jump back on a single, boom, jab. Switch your leg, squat single, jump both, squat single. There you go, just like that.
Final, final round, guys, 10 seconds. Three, two, one. Now we're going all six punches. One, two, three, four, five, six. Knee, left kick. One, two, three, four, five, six. Right knee, right kick. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Left knee, left kick. One, two, three, four, five, six. Right knee, right kick. All six punches. Simple. Simple and effective. Go, 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 go. Nice work, nice work. There you go. Pump it up, pump it up. All up, all up. 10 more seconds and we're going to start all over again with that single leg squat thrust. Three, two, one, you're going immediately. Single leg squat thrust. Go, 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 go. There's no time to waste. Go, go. Hit it. Final round. Final two minutes right here. This is it. Then it's just the stretching. Squat down low. Don't lean over. Don't lean, don't don't go like this because I'll be on your back. You want to squat even on that chair or that couch. You want to squat. You don't want to just lean forward. You need to be so much pressure on your back. So pay attention to that squat, please. Yes, it's more difficult because it's a single leg. Yes. Going all the way down towards the floor. So much glutes, so much quads, so much hamstrings. Ten more seconds here, and you're going to do one more time through the punches. One, two, three, four, five, six. Knee and kick on the left. One, two, three, four, five, six. Knee and kick on the right. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Knee, kick. One, two, three, four, five, six. Knee, kick. Nice work. Sixteen, fifteen, final fourteen. All out. Ten. Almost there. There you go. Seven, six. Five and four and three and two and one. Finito. Awesome job. Let's stretch on the floor. I want you guys to lay down on your belly, please. Flat down on your belly. Lay down on your belly. And I want you to bring your right leg in. Laying down flat down on the belly. Bring your right leg in. Push your hips forward. And switch your legs. Very good. Now release those legs slowly. I want you to bring your forearms right in front of you. I want you to stay on your forearms. Your belly button is all the way down. And now push from your hands and expand slowly, fully extending your hands on the ground. There you go. And compressing the spine. We did a lot of squats, a lot of single leg, a lot of crawl up. This is all flexion, forward. So when on earth do we decompress it? Never, unless it's really with the stretching. So this is very important. Even after a long day of work, when you sit in front or maybe you just, I don't know, you're doing so much remodeling at home, so I don't know what's your position there. Are you on the floor? Are you on your knees? Just sitting back, doing the compression, Pushing sometimes your hips forward throughout the day. I sit on my desk too and just decompressing, just like you too. Stretching throughout the day is so important. Getting that little break. 
after what you're doing, that a few minutes break when you get up, get refill your water, go for a few minutes, like literally get your hand, eyes off the computer, whatever you do, decompress yourself fully and you can go back to it. Okay. Time. Let's, let's unmute yourself. Whew. How are you doing? Phew. That was tough. <laughs> tough, but good. You already feeling like, right? How are you feeling? Good. Accomplished. There you go. Yes. What else Jeez. is happening? Josephine, I want to see your elves today. My what? Your elves on the page. Are you still making them? Uh, the stuff ones, yeah, not as much. Uh, most people already started the elf. Uh, they started them already. You know, they're already putting them around their house. So I know, but some people just buy people for holidays as well. Yeah, yeah, I know. I'm, I'm making a new one. I'm making a new one that doesn't have to be a uh, elf one. It could be anything. You could put anything Christmas gift inside. There you so, go. What uh, about the balloons? Why don't you post them on the page today? People might want them for. Uh, their okay. Christmas. All right. Yeah. Post I'll them. Post some more them. today. You never know. You never know. Okay. Yes. Joseph, how are you doing? Awesome. <laughs> exhausted I, awesome. Exhausted by awesome. Yes, yes. I know you you I just saw your post on the on the Instagram. You're doing a lot of remodeling too, right? Yeah, that's, that's my business. Yeah. Yeah. Do you do you build furniture too? The furniture is more of a hobby, but occasionally when I have a customer that wants something custom that's like something unique, I'll do it for them. But usually it's it's just more of a hobby. Okay, but the remodeling, is it like just... Um, yeah, I do like... Pages? Yeah, I, I have a general contracting company. And okay. then we, we also like buy some real estate and fix it up, flip. We own a couple of buildings like for holding. Well, that, that's nice. Awesome. You see, good to know. Whoever yeah. is going to be watching this video, Mike, you never know. It's Guys, this is... The VIP page is also like networking. Things like this. This is like your fellow speak freaks. You know, so mm -hmm. you never know. Maybe somebody needs some help. You should like announce what you're doing and uh, and let people know because somebody might need something and they're not gonna go to you. They go to a stranger. <laughs> so make sure that you maybe know, do a post for everybody. Yeah. Maybe yeah. Do a post for everybody. You know. Yeah. What are like they that? doing? We'll put up their their, their business yeah. and stuff. Look, I have that painting of Tyson dog on my wall just because of you. <laughs> Thank you. I look at him every single day. He's in my 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 office. So yeah. So you never know, right? All right. Again, if you need help with anything, please let us know. Post it on the page. Ask us. I know you guys are doing very good. You're posting. You you asking questions. Josephine, you 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 also. You look great. You look great. Oh yeah, yeah. I mean, so I don't post as much as I used to, but uh, <laughs> it's like but unless I need help, and you're doing yeah, great. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. Even when you just throw something because. People wanted to know, maybe like announce, you know, how much weight you lost. That's good because we have so many people in the group right now that wanted to lose. We're not talking about 10 pounds. We, we're talking about 50 or 100 pounds people that join. And mm -hmm. for them just to see from a fellow freak that they posted the change or the struggles that they've been through, it's such a motivation too that it's possible. That's what it's, you know, like like when you started, right? You and 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 Gary, between both of you guys lost like hundred pounds. It's such yeah. a big number, mm -hmm. you know, big number. So uh, it's good to post it and and announce it and let people know. And of course, look, guys, we have the holiday season is coming. I know. You can buy twenty one days for someone under the tree. Literally, mm -hmm. buy twenty one days. Write a card that they have to just with my number on it and mm. say contact this coach you are all set what you need to do call her text her send me a message of this person's name so i know and after the holidays i know in on january 1st contact them and set them up for the upcoming year like it's 21 days what a great gift i'm gonna be giving all the teachers from texas all of them they will be getting the gift cards like this because they sit at the desk, and I know we talk about it, how people are depressed and sad and they don't have the gyms to go to. It's such an awesome gift. So please, uh, if you have a person, one person, it takes one person, just buy them 21 days. 
Like, because we spend more on gifts, on other gifts, really. When you think about it, we spend more on other things. There are people mm -hmm. not even, they're not gonna even use it sometimes. But this, most people, mm -hmm. more than those at least five pounds, most people, <laughs> right? It's always somewhere in the back of their head, and especially now, after the, after the holidays. After All right. Thanks. Bye. Have a great day. All right. Bye. Have a.